Hi everyone, hola a todos et bonjour à tous. Today I'm going to show you how I made this obstacle avoiding robot. Empecemos. Okay, I found this great model on Thinkiverse and I thought to give it a try as it seems very easy to do. Before printing, I made some improvements on the model in Fusion 360. The first one was to do a hold on the top to eventually install an ER sensor. The second one was to design some supports and do some chamfers to ease the printing of the part. The third one was to open a hole to have some access to the reset of the Arduino Nano. And finally, I improved the holes to ease the mounting of the motors. And here is the final result of the 3D model. As you can see here, this is the correct position for painting. You can turn off the supports or activate them only for touching the build plate. The estimated printing time is around 9 hours in total. You will find the link for the STL files on the video description down below. Let's check the electronics. At the beginning of the project, I wanted to use an ear sensor, but I was never able to make it work. Anyway, you will find the bill of materials for this project on the video description. Before assembly everything, you will need to prepare some components. It's necessary to solder some wires to the motors and don't worry for the polarity, as we can change the connection later. You will need also to prepare the LEDs and remember that you need to protect them with a 220 ohm resistors on the negative leg. It will be also helpful to prepare some jumpers. For the assembly, I recommend to use some hot glue. You will also need some 3mm screws to install the motor driver and two 200mm long plastic ties to install the motors. Now let's assemble the upper part. First, install the LEDs. Before installing the ultrasonic sensor, be sure to wire it and use some hot glue again to fix it in place. For the wiring, I recommend you to print the diagram and go step by step. Be careful and remember that we have the Arduino Nano mirrored. A quick advice, use some hot glue to avoid these connections. Ok, for the Arduino program, I remixed one that I found on the Arduino Hub. I put some comments to guide you step by step and to help you to understand how this program works. All the information will be available on my GitHub to download it for free. In summary, we will first measure the distance with the ultrasonic sensor and depending the readings, we will move in a way or another. Feel free to practice some coding by changing some values. The final step is to check your program. Please do this before connecting the battery. And here it is, the final result of this project. I had so much fun with this and I think it is an excellent project to introduce someone to the 3D printing world and to learn some Arduino coding. And now it's time to do some tests. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please consider subscribing. My name is Carlos and see you next time.